Whoa, dude, a fucking orb flew out of your head, bro. Are you serious? Uh-huh. All right, guys, so we just saw the most scariest shit we've ever experienced since we started doing investigations. I have never experienced, I have never experienced anything like this when I started by myself. Because yeah. I would go to cemeteries and I would investigate on my own. And I had never seen or experienced anything like this before. And there's three of us here. Leon wasn't able to witness it or see it, but me and my brother did. And that was by far the scariest shit I've ever experienced, man. <laughs> well, doing investigations. And it's fucking crazy because when I was standing back there, all I kept feeling was something fuck around with me. Yeah. And look. That was amazing. It fuck with I'm it. pretty sure we did capture that on camera. It was way too bright, right? What's that? It was too bright not to capture. Yeah, it was too bright. That's cool. Wow. Hey, that is a week. That was just... Stand where you were at, Joseph? Let's try to debunk this. I'm not saying that we didn't see what we saw, but... Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah. No, yeah, I thought. We, we saw what we saw, bro. Oh, yeah. Definitely. There's oh, nothing, my gosh. There's nothing that will re yeah, imitate that. No. There's nothing. no reflection of the black light. Nothing. What the fuck was that, bro? Cause I was like right in this area right here. Yeah, yes. and we were both, and we were looking in that direction because of the red light. It looked like there was something there. Yeah. And when my brother shined the light, it went this way. Oh, oh, that was creepy. Oh my gosh. I literally still got goosebumps. My nipples are getting hard again. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever that was, or whatever that was, thank you. Thank you for showing yourself because I was asking you to show yourself, yeah. Leon. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude. You should have seen that with us. <laughs> oh my god. And I'm pretty sure you could tell that when somebody's not telling the truth or faking it. Oh yeah. But we saw that. Oh my gosh. Dude, there's nothing. Now we are ran that that shit, but I was pointing this way. Unable to leave up that No, something. you can't. There's no light that comes from upstairs. Nope. Guys, the electricity is completely off in this building except for one room. Everything else is off. Even down here? Even down here? Just that one room. I don't know, bro, but I'm just, I just really hope you're not coming. I'm to experience the security system, of course. I mean, of course, we're here with us, but I've seen it. I don't think I'm going to be able to sleep tonight. I mean, that's straight up paranormal. Yes. This, that, this is why I do it. I'm not going to stand over there, dude. <laughs> I'm not going to stand And that's crazy. That's crazy. Joseph was hearing sh shit back there when he was standing over there. I'm feeling it. And I'm telling you right now, I'm bitching the fuck out of the fucking 15 minute alone challenge. Fuck that. Yeah, I don't think I'm down for that 20 minute alone challenge either. Oh, I'm bitching the fuck out. I'll be the first one to say it. Yeah, I wouldn't do it. Uh -huh. Me either. Especially if it's, if it's showing itself like that? No. Uh, no way. The fuck out of me. And I was standing over there, dude. Just saw uh, uh, like a red orb. Really? On the other side of the pillar right there. And, and this right here? Yeah, it just showed up on the left side, too. Did you hear that? Okay. Yeah. Can you show yourself again? So Leon can, Leon can see you this time. I missed you. Fuck. Has anybody ever seen anything like that? No, I don't think that. No. That was usually a lot smaller. That was an apparition, bro. Yeah, it was. And I wish we had a fucking camera holding it right now, man. The way we just fucking saw what we just saw. Yeah, because don't lie. It was literally, literally fucking floating up in the air. Yeah, right in the middle of that space. It was like maybe, maybe like right here. Okay. Maybe a little bit higher? Yeah, higher. But it looked weird. When my brother pointed the light, it went this way. Nice. Oh, that looked creepy as hell, yeah, man. He was trying to get away from the light. Yeah. They you saw it. You yeah. saw it without the light on. That's why I pointed it over there. That's why I was like, there's it. nothing. There's nothing, Josh. That is that crazy. Bought that. That's insane. There's nothing. Dude. I can't believe we, we saw that with our own two eyes. What is that? Did you hear that? Sound. Yeah. yeah, I heard that too. I just saw a red light. That cool, kind of what you just saw right now too. Yeah. I saw it over here now. Okay. There's something back there in that corner. 
Just is showing itself every once in a while. Hey, listen, whoever's back there in the back corner, thank you very much for that. Uh, I appreciate it. I know these guys love you. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we're here for. You just made their night. You made all of our nights. It's really, really cool. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> they are. What the fuck was that? I don't know. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah, it was. It's scary at the uh, same time. <laughs> get the film of light. Let's try this. Uh, if you're hiding, you don't have to hide anymore. We've got the light turned off. Don't be afraid of it. We're not going to turn it off for now. If you want to, you can go back to where you were. I mean, I, I'd, I'd like to see you. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty special. There's something moving around back there. Yeah. It's real hard to see, though. I feel like there is something back there for sure. Yeah. That, that's an area we get a lot of activity. So then that, that goes to prove that that probably goes to that story what you're talking about. Yeah, it could be. Could be. Did someone hang themselves in here? Did you end your life in here? It's an absolutely terrible way to go, a terrible place to go. How depressed you must have been to, to do that here. You wanted to make sure that no one found you until it was done, huh? Was it worth it? I feel like you just got heavier. Are you glad you did it? I mean, that's not something I'd ever want to do. I know sometimes your head is in a, in a spot, in an area, uh, you're super, super sad and depressed and just nothing can cure it. I understand that. But it's not something anyone else should do. Do you agree? If you agree with me, can you make a noise back there? You can show yourself again like you did a minute ago. And even though you're deceased now, your spirit lives on. You're still very special to us. They can't come home with us. You're supposed to stay here until someone comes and gets you. It's not us. Something just moved in the center. I saw that. Tiny, tiny light. It's not us. We can't help you. It's against your rules on your side for us to help you. We're only allowed to observe, interact with you. Okay, something just moved again. I saw that. That's all we're allowed to do. We can't, we can't actually help you. You know, we can try to tell you how that you can cross over. It's almost like something with claws right in front of us. Um, so what you can do, it was like right here. What I saw was something that looked like this. Like oh, that. Shit. <laughs> So what I can tell you is, I can tell you how to help yourself get to that point where you can cross over. Okay? Now the best I know is that you have to be kind, you have to be honest, you have to help other people or spirits, you have to help them become a helpful person, and become the type of person they want on the other side. Otherwise, you're going to end up staying here forever, or at least for a very long time. So what, what you can do, and I tried to help Dave with this. I think it helped Dave cross to a next spot to get a little bit further away from this that we're at right now. Okay, there's something wobbly about where you guys saw it. It's like glowing slightly. I don't know if you guys are seeing it. Maybe it's not. I was playing trick. Um, From the left side? From like that, where they put that charcoal? Uh, yeah, it's like right in the center of this gap between the two pillars. Okay. 
So when I told Dave, because Dave and, and, and I and, and some of my team members, we would kind of provoke Dave, kind of piss him off a little bit. And we weren't trying to be actually really mean. We were just trying to get a rise out of him. Uh, I think he enjoyed it a little bit going back and forth. Ooh, something just right in front of us here. Um, Fully fit. Yeah, you see it? It was, it was like right, right where you were pointing. Yeah. yeah. And we were kind of going back and forth, and when he said stop, we stopped. Because we knew that he wasn't having a good time at that point. We figured he was having a good time. But I tried to help him to become that better person. And he changed over time from being, you know, kind of a jerk. <laughs> in a good way, but kind of being a jerk into being much more normal. And instead of being Devil Dave, he became Dave. And it seems like when we try to reach out to him, he's further and further away from us. Further and further away from this basement. This terrible place. Let me know if that helps you at all. Okay? Okay, was that you? What was that? Heard that right? Yeah. Sound like yeah. Sound like oh. somebody oh. sighing or just oh, yeah. like fucking. Oh. I definitely heard that though. But yes, just like Leon said, you cannot follow us home. You need to stay here until you can find a place that you can feel comfortable and try to move on. You do not have my permission or my brother's permission or Leon's permission to follow us or attach yourself to us. So please stay here. Whatever, whoever it was that we saw. Did you see us back there? Where? I saw something moving back there. <laughs> <laughs> We do appreciate you. Thank you for your time and thank you for showing yourself to us. It's been amazing. Yes, it was an amazing, amazing experience. Dude, I had a nice night. Yeah, I had a and nice night. I hope that one day we can return with your permission and try to communicate with you again. I'd like to find out where you're at. I want to find out where you're at in your journey. It's been entirely yes. too long that you're down here. Sometime, if you would like to know how long you've been down here, I'll tell you what year it is. But until then, you know, you're, I'll wait until you want to know. When you say you want to know what year it is, then I'll tell you, okay? I don't want to make it worse on you or, or anything like that. I don't want to get in, in like ruin your journey, okay? I really do hope that you can move along. I really do hope that you impre in, in, improve yourself. The only thing I want to know, is this the Mexican soldier? I heard a lot of noise over here to my right. Did you hear that over here? Yeah. Almost sound like somebody took a very short step. I never got your name. I thought it was Raul. But we had so many names coming through the radio at that time, I couldn't tell what your name was. Now, he may not speak English. It's the shit fucking water. Oh, I did. I scared the hell out of me. I scared the shit out of me, too. <laughs> what kind of question did you want to ask him? No, I can't. I'm not kidding. Okay. Maybe we can translate it's, it for you? Yeah, it's, it's the. El Soldado Mexicano. Mm -hmm. El es el Soldado Mexicano. Is this the Civil War or War Between the States veteran? Is that who that was? Okay, so let me just move to my right. Right there. Okay, it just went past me. Wait, why is that blinking? Oh, I think it's going dead. Really? Yeah. 
No way. Yeah. That's right. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, yeah it's blinking. Ooh, it took a lot of the energy out of it, huh? Oh, yeah. What's that, seven batteries now? Yeah. yeah. Seven batteries? Yep, and was, that one's actually the infrared that was blinking. So now that one was going dead. Wow. Oh, yeah, I just burped. That was a strange, because that almost, like each one of those almost sounded like something farted. The growls. Yeah. They were different. So so we've, we've got, we've heard two different types of growls. Is that a female voice? Yeah. So one growl we hear sounds like a dog growling, like, like mm -hmm. that. And the other growl we hear is a very deep growl. It's like, Whoa. It sounds it's more a, demonic. Yeah, it's a big growl. We don't know if it's the same thing doing it, but these growls sound a little bit different over here. It's yeah. almost like somebody's playing a joke on us. What was that, bro? <laughs> what was that, three or four? Yeah, That's three. three. No, it was four. It was four. Four growls. Four yeah. growls tonight. Yeah. What the fuck was that? Wow. What the fuck was that? <laughs> we I hope we caught that on camera. But me and Josh saw the same damn thing. <sighs> <laughs> I gotta admit, it, Leon, man, that is by far an amazing place to be. I'm not even in that fucking red This is the okay. reason. I'll go with you. This is the reason that the soda is world famous. <laughs> it already is, actually. Yeah, oh, it is, huh? Damn, that time went fast. Last time I looked at my clock, it was 10. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, to tell you guys the truth, we had an amazing, amazing night. Tonight's investigation was beyond our expectations. It was, it was just fucking amazing. And... We can't thank none other than Leon for having us here tonight and we just saw some crazy shit and we just hope we caught it on camera. And Leon, thank you. Thank you so much. For, Fuck! <laughs> thank you so much for having us tonight. And we really hope that we, we really hope that we can come back again and you know, yeah, me too. I hope over. I can come back. Oh of course. <laughs> of course. That we definitely gotta come back and good. that was fun. Hopefully amazing. hopefully my brother Ernie can come with us next time and so you can experience what we experienced, but man, other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this night, uh, tonight's episode. We are Borderland Paranormal Investigators. See you guys next time. Keep it scary. That shit was scary, man. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking scary. <laughs>